Hey there, everybody, my name is Kate, and welcome back for another video of Civ 6. We're gonna continue this series. Now, we're gonna go ahead and skip to the next turn already. I did equip my mods. Hopefully, they're gonna work today. We're already, we're already gonna know if they work or not. Where we is, is the camp the midday neighbors. <laughs> Blood fades pay at men at great expense. All right, if you say so, buddy. So we got uh, Scotland obviously talking with us and everything. We're getting attacked. I don't know from where. May I make a suggestion? Great ball court is also very impressive. I would like to have seen them play a game, although it sounds like the end was pretty violent. I think it was safer to be a spectator. Probably was, Sean. So shitting it's up, boys. Here we go, the infamous temple. This is where they would uh, basically bring people, right? The sun would be right there. They would bring people there. And if the sun was still there, until there was an eclipse and everything coming up, uh, they would sacrifice people to uh, basically get their heart, bring it up on their hands, behead those people afterwards, bring down the head and then the body. Uh, to the people they were captured these bodies captured these heads for trophies stuff like that in honor of the sun their god obviously so that's very interesting we got all these things opening up chichita brings renewed trade and prosperity good never criticize a rifleman until you've walked a mile in his shoes that way he'll be barefoot and you'll be out of range that's true that rifling boys why is a woman to be treated differently? Woman's suffrage will succeed, despite this miserable guerrilla opposition. Victoria Woodhull, that's what she said. Suffrage, we got democracy, boys. All right, so the mods do work, because obviously we got uh, the wonder done and everything. Appease the gods, what, uh, ongoing competition. What the fuck is that? The gods have warned us, the end of the world is coming. They will grant their followers boons, but they f uh, but we first must prove uh, our fervor. Only the most zealous will be rewarded. The members are complete to see who can get the highest score. Okay, so we can ha we have to get the highest score. What? You are in eighth place. What's the what does that mean? Using sacrifice agency uh, agency unit action with the soothsayer unit, gaining score actual to the combat strength. So I gotta gain score by sacrificing some of my units, like real life with um, the Mayan. We're gonna sacrifice our own people. Members so two year can use the sacrifice agency unit action on friendly unit agency to an active volcanoes. I can do that. I can do that to Laventa. Laventa is my city state, so I can just sacrifice uh, <laughs> Laventa's unit, which is pretty much garbage to do that. But uh, if I have to sacrifice somebody, I'll sacrifice them, not my units. That's for sure. We did get a knight for free, which is kind of cool. So I guess uh, we'll keep him right here just so he can get an area right here with a general idea of where to go. We do have this guy. We were sending him over here so we can get the religion done right here. Right here. So we got the builder. We got already these two resources built. Do we have anything else going on? Not really. Where do we, what do we want exactly, boys? We don't have any resources that we can build. This, uh, this guy is dormant. This one is gonna explode soon enough. The, the tile are gonna be moved on. These ones are probably gonna explode too. I'm not entirely sure, boys. So many volcanoes in the area. It's very dangerous. Uh, yeah, I don't know where to send that builder. I don't know what to do with him, boys. I don't want to build a farm, right? Because I don't really need a farm right now. So I think I'm just going to let him sleep for now. We don't really have any resources to exploit. Uh, and uh, this guy was sending him right here, right? Yeah. To attack uh, these guys. We're going to continue on our search right here. All over across the, sh uh, the, s the shores or of the African people. So... Dynamite, our next research, we got rifling, right? So that, that means we can basically upgrade our range unit into a, uh, into a ranger. Uh, dynamite, we can have some mountain tunnels. 
would be interesting fertilizer uh war planes would be crazy but uh, i kind of want to do interstellation industrialization whatever just to get the coal another resource right and uh, over here the civic we got suffrage done which means we can go democracy right we can choose it now total alternative what is that sydney opera house the shipwreck okay let's get capitalism just to get some shopping malls okay and neighborhoods so we still don't have anything over here in uh, our capital obviously we can't build um this a neighborhood this is not not worth anything so we're just going to go ahead and build one of these. Forbidden City. Um, I'm not sure. Which one do we want to do for, go for here? What's the Forbidden City give us? Culture. Uh, plus uh, great works of art slots. Yeah, we can have some slots that we can get some great or works of art. I can do that. Great engineer points. Not really. Plus four cultures. Not really, that I don't really care. Casa de Concentration, Great Merchant Points per Turn, Great Work Slots. Uh, or the Mika Minakashi Temple. Let's uh, let's go for this one. Oh, I can't build that. No, not this one then. Casa de Concentration, okay. Is there only one place I can build that? It looks like there's only one place I can build those things then. Oh, hold on. What was that? The Venetian Arsenal, I can actually build it on the water. Re uh, yeah, right here, because it's going to be closer to these two cities. It's going to help the, uh, the two cities. So there we go. In one turn, we're going to have another wonder. Over here, we do need to work on all of these things. I'm going to work on that. Just purchase it with the faith and everything. And also purchase the library with the gold. There we go. So that we got, we got the library. Which we're making more science because of that. And now we can basically... What do we uh, research here? Do we go for the canal or anything else? Uh, or university? No, university I can just purchase it. And how much is it? It's around 600 though. It's going to take a while. But it doesn't matter to me. Aqueduct. We could get an aqueduct. But we don't really need housing or anything. A canal would be really important I feel like. What's that over there? Oh, no, it's just a bunch of woods. No, I'm going to place that right there. It's important to have canals everywhere, boys. So it's going to prevent flooding big time. So it's, I feel like these cities are not going to flood because we got two canals like that right here. I'm going to get the walls right here done. It's only going to take me one turn. It's important to have the best walls possible. Medieval walls for you, buddy. Yeah, I don't know. For you, I kind of want you to have the arbor on. Let's give you an arbor, actually, yeah. Let's give you an arbor uh, right here. It's where you're going to get the most money out. And new government type. We're going to go for democracy, boys. We're going to switch it off. There we go. So that's what I wanted. Discovery of computers by the Maya sets the world stage for the future discoveries in the atomic era. Well, there we go. Just uncovered the computers along with the democracy, which is really good. So now we got uh, three uh, slots like that. So that's what it looks like. We got democracy right here. Next uh, options are going to be these. But for now, we got to focus on our policies themselves. We got another slot available for this one first. We're going to look. Plus four housing amenities for all cities, uh, at least three special districts. We're going to get that one. Big time, boys. All the housing and all that would be great. Uh, the next thing, uh, we could just get that right there, I guess. Yep, yeah, get that right over there. And uh, for the rest, let me see if I get... I uh, approve all nitro resources would be great. But the plus for combat with non-religions, uh, not really. Units have less, 50% per less, uh, percent less combat strength. Not really, I don't really need that. Military academies, seaports, and renaissance walls generate plus two science. We're going to get that. And yields gained from pillaging coastal raids and plundering trade routes are 50%. Doesn't matter to me. 50% gold and resource discount on all unit upgrade. That's perfect. That's exactly what we want, boys. So we're going to take that. And uh, yeah, we're moving out big time. That's really great for us. I got to bring him back uh, towards our, uh, our city, uh, Copen, because I need him to... 
the start being a, a new or the next unit, right? The next thing. Espionage, boys. She's happy about that. She's happy about the fact that we got some spies already and stuff like that. It's in their armory. Have this inscription. Happy is that city, which in time of peace thinks of war. The Venetian Arsenal, boys. There we go. I think the human we got industrialization. Continue capitalism. There we go. We got all that done. So we're moving up big time right now just because of that. We do have some fishery resource right there. There we go. We can send our builder right here. And yeah, I'm just going to uh, make him sleep. Uh, our knight right here. I'm going to send him back right there. And okay. Frigate, continue your search for other worlds and stuff like that. So far, it's the only ones I can see over there in Africa. Uh, what else do we have? Biplanes. Ironclads we could get. What is that? Solar farms. Launched Earth satellites. Some satellites? Now, before that, we do need to get all the resources possible. So, so aluminum for sure. And we're going to go... I guess we could go for... Let's go for totalitarianism or whatever. All these other different uh, things, right, that we can get. There is some barbarians over there. I don't know what these guys are doing. They're not doing a, a good job at protecting their people. Uh, I did get something. I cannot upgrade the bombard yet. Okay. What about you? The mili uh, you are going to go there. Yep. Okay. And you, I'm just going to send you right here. The next turn, you're going to be able to start attacking these guys. Uh, claim a great person, a great admiral. Uh, grants one promotional level. I'm going to pass on him. I don't feel like I need these uh, great general, uh, great admirals. Those are not really important to me. Uh, what did I upgrade? International trade routes provide plus one gold per luxury and strategic resource improved. Oh, I'm going to keep it like that. I am already gaining come, uh, some gold right here. I I do want to start. Well, I'm going to choose a production over our new things here or new places. Uh, War Department. What do we want? The Royal Society or the National History Museum. We're going to do the National History Museum, boys. Why not? Why not? That's going to be much better than anything else. Uh, university, it's going to take a while before I get the money. Let me just get university right away. And uh, over here, uh, we should probably work on the bank just to get even more money. I think we should do that. Just work on the bank over Chichen Itza, boys. It's funny because we got the Chichen Itza right here. It should be right here instead, but hey, it's, it's all fine. It's good. It's, it's fine as it is. We don't have any money. We need to make more money. Even though that's a lot, that's not enough yet. So lighthouse, it's going to give us more food and stuff like that. Not, not really. I need to work on all my districts first. So I'm thinking we don't need any of these things uh, right here. Theodore Square, probably. I think so, yeah, because if we want museums and stuff like that. Uh, aerodrome, maybe. Uh, I'm not, I don't want an aerodrome just yet. I think observatory probably, but, uh, that's just in case my mods don't work. Uh, theater square. Let's just get a theater square just so I can get some wonders or, you know, some good stuff, uh, here and there. I'm actually going to purchase, purchase some land. No, I'm going to save my money right now. I'm going to save my money, build the, the, the thing right there. And that should be good. We're going to go up to the other civilizations and try to sell some stuff. We're going to declare friendship. She doesn't want to be friends with us. So that's fine. That's fine then. Yeah, I can sell you that, I guess. That and some jade. You want some jade in this, uh, honey? For, for 30 turns. One per 30 turns. Yeah, I can give you that. And in exchange, you could just give me some gold per turn. Uh, six. Uh, six gold per turn. Can you give me more? I don't know. I don't want to test it. Yeah. Six goals per turn. You uh, you don't want to give me more. That's fine. Six goals per turn is fine by me. All right. So that's that. Uh, Simeon. Let's try to s sell with him. Does he want to give me some gold for these two resources? Nine gold per turn. All right. That's perfect. That's exactly what I was expecting. There we go. So now we're gaining like 15 more gold per turn because of that. That's perfect. And we got totalitarianism or whatever. So basically fascism that we're not going to use. 
So we got that. We're actually going to send him right here because it makes more sense. And we got the religion over Copen. Perfect. Send you right here. Upgrade you. It costs a lot to upgrade you, but it is what it is. We got a ranger unit now. Perfect. We uh, got the musketman, which you can start to attack. We got the campman done for. Let's start to uh, right here. I'm actually going to attack this scout unit. There we go with my frigate. Get some XP out of that. New research. Now, what do we want to go for? I feel like before going for that, we want to go for something that, you know, makes sense in terms of speed and everything, right? Because we can go for all of this right away, but I feel like we should probably go for that first. These things. Military Academy and all that. Fertilizers, for sure. We got to go for fertilizers. It's going to help out the growth and everything. Recommended. Communism, not really. Yeah. Let's unlock it. Let's just unlock it. And uh, okay, so we're done with that. Do we have another wonder we can build? Forbidden City? Is that the... No, that's not the thing I built. That's the Venetian Arsenal. So is there anything I can actually build that's not on land? Because I've got plenty of water tiles. But uh, I don't have anything. No. So I can't build any more stuff right here. It's either that or... Yeah. I'm basically stuck right here. I can't build anything. So what I could do then is just build a couple of units. Be uh, yeah. Observation balloons. I can just do that. Promotion to support. Yeah. I could just do that. Send the balloons, right? I feel like maybe uh, I could upgrade my, like, really my naval uh, army. My naval uh, fleet. Let's just get an observation balloon, boys. Just to see what it can possibly do for us, right? It can probably be help us just using for uh, as a scout and stuff like that and for you you still have uh, some couple of stuff to build i'm seeing the uh, uh the neighborhood would give us more housing or stuff like that but this would give us more amenities i don't have space for an aqueduct though so i'm thinking neighborhood plus six right here for the neighborhood we're gonna take that and over here for you encampment or uh, what do we what do we want exactly? We were done with the last thing, aerodrome. I'm not entirely sure. We don't have s options for an arbor just yet, so I'm thinking aqueduct. No, not aqueduct. Industrial zone could be really good for you, buddy. Aerodrome. Let's start to get an aerodrome. Yeah, I kind of am interesting in that. So let's get an aerodrome right here in Chichen Itza. It's gonna be the one that's gonna give us the planes and everything. Lighthouse, amphitheater. Ah, I don't know what I'm gonna go for. There's so many stuff I gotta build, right? I'm thinking amphitheater. Just so I can get some works in there. Build some works and stuff like that. We got a new promotion. Do we? Yeah, we actually need um, yeah, a governor over here. So let's find one of them. Envoys, religious, builders, plus one build charge. 50. Oh. This one, there we go. More uh, science and more culture from this city right there. Uh, we got some new stuff, some new uh, cards, of course, that uh, I don't know where they are. Doesn't matter. I'm not going to use any of them. How many more turns since the next era? 13 to 27 turns. It's coming up, actually. But we're still going to be in a golden era, so we're just fine. We're dominating everything almost, except for the religious part and the military part as well, really. We don't have, yeah, we're not that strong in military wise, I guess. We're, although we do have some, yeah. I thought we were pretty good in military. I guess it's, I don't know, boys. Maybe we're not, we don't have enough, like, a uh, military itself. I don't know how it works exactly, boys. Whatever. Before we skip to the next turn, we do have the builder right here. We were sending him right here, yeah, because he, he did have um, a well resource. So we got that. We also have another well resource or fish resource that we can use here. So we're going to have to do that. Also, I, oh yeah, I forgot, right? I can't forget about uh, getting one of these things, uh, one of these guys right here. The soothsayer, I got to get one of them, yeah. Let's get one of them right now. And with him, we're going to sacrifice some people right here. Definitely going to sacrifice some people. The, citizen, the citizens of Oxmall are the first in the world to discover that the only thing better than living in Oxmall is living in a slightly cleaner place outside of it. The neighborhood, boys. 
Fertilizers is done. Is class, class struggle and warplanes. Okay, we've unlocked warplanes. Uh, we're gonna renew the mission over here for the spy. We got the balloons. Uh, now nah, with the balloons, I don't know. Or we're just gonna send him right there. There we go. You soothsayer. Now what do you do exactly? I'm gonna send him right here. At least it's gonna cause a disaster. Right? It's gonna be one close to my uh, one of five people, right, or whatever. I need to do it. I don't want to do it, but I need to, so I guess I'll go, I'll have, I'm gonna have to. Uh, what else do we have? Can we send him anywhere else? Really, not. I guess we can start sending him on the uh, the south towards the Grand Colombian people. Rainforest regrown. That's interesting. Choose a research. Uh, we're gonna go for. What do we gotta go for? Pendulum, the big band. Not really cavalry. Let's get the military science. Just we can upgrade our knights. And we're gonna get professional sports. Uh, neighborhood. I not I don't I still don't have anything here. So now that we can't build anything, we know for sure that. We're gonna get a fill cannon in the city. Why not? Just get a fill cannon in the city. We're gonna produce military units with uh with basically we're just gonna produce units with this uh, city itself. Uh over here. Okay, so let's choose the production for all of our cities right here. So what do we have here? Shopping mall, absolutely. We're gonna work on that. Give us more money, and an anger. Yeah, we're gonna work on our anger and everything. We can get some planes. We can get two planes right here. With the anger, it's probably gonna upgrade that. Art museum, or um, archaeology. I'm gonna go for art museum. And over here, I'm not sure where they went. I'm just gonna head back. A uh, new government type. Hold on, before I do that gonna continue to send my scout right here frigate continue to take a look everywhere really okay new government type I don't care I'm not taking any of these uh, don't feel like I have any policies that are interesting enough we're getting 93 gold per turn especially because of our trades with other civilizations and all that that helps out tremendously and also right our city right here, I just found out that it was population 5. I am going to send back this guy because we're going to be able to upgrade him in the next turn. So, like that. Yeah. Copen is uh, popula uh, population 5, which means we can get a, uh, another city, a 5th city. So, we're going to uh, head, uh, go ahead and do that right here along the shore. So, we're going to we already know our process that for the settlers, I just go ahead and get them right away. So where I want to go for him, one, two, three, or one, two, three, four, five. I could go right here. One, two, three, four, five. I think over here, right over here would be perfect. So the shore right there would be my next city. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, next city. There we go, boy. So we're going to get the settler right here um, and found a new city. Fifth city overall. There we go, boys. So right next to it, uh, his neighbors and everything. It already has the some some good uh, production and everything, just because it's really close, right? Uh, we're gonna need a builder, but my builder was already sending him over there. So and I can't get another one because this is uh, the type of builder I was because this is the type of builder I already built by myself. So I can't get him right now. We're just gonna focus on the main stuff right now. I guess we could focus on these uh, these little things too. Uh, ancient walls, not really, but water mill. Like I can purchase these things right here. There we go. And I guess sewers, not really. We could go for sewers actually, but um, let's just uh, go for ancient walls, and we're gonna see afterwards. So Palink is our next city, boys. We got so many, uh, so much stuff going on. So we get. We can get two airplanes. We're going to start working on that right here. Okay, so we got military science and professional sports, which means we can get uh, stades, boys, stadiums. And our expression of professional will define humanity's future in the Tarmac era. There we go. Grows and its people take pride in traveling metropolitan life. Good. Good, good, good. So that's that. Actually, now we got a new city. Let's see back my missionary. You are just going to sleep there. Or right, actually. Never mind, because you do have a promotion, right? Right away you have a promotion. So garrison, there we go. That's perfect. And you are going to go there. You're going to build some stuff. Uh, you're going to continue your search over there. You're going to continue over here. Signe is a 250 square mile tiger trap 
made up on massive obelisks, riddled with jagged spears. And yes, they will cut your pretty face. The Chinzi de Bemaraha. All right, interesting, boys. So we got that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and kill that uh, scout unit with our frigate. I don't know what happened. City unpowered. Need more housing. A bunch of stuff. Discovered of natural wonder. A fire started. Oh, it's just over there. Okay, it doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, choose a research. The uh, next research we're going to go for is the pendulum, boys. Uh, choose a civic. And we're going to go for cultural heritage. Choose a production. All right. Over here, we're, see, we're doing uh, basically military units right here. Uh, over here. So I'm thinking uh, right here first. We do need to upgrade him. We don't have enough gold. Okay, we don't, we're don't. we going to have to wait a little bit more. So I actually need some engineers themselves, right? To get some cities, uh, get some roads done over these cities. Yeah. Need to connect some roads. Let's just get industrial city. Uh, yeah, let's get industrial logistics so that we get, get some power in here. I guess because we unlock the power, right? The uh, energy and everything that we can get that. Uh, next thing, encampment. Not really, don't need that. Theater square, we already have one. So we don't need to focus on that. I'm thinking what we can go for though is a water parks. Could probably get, uh, go for that. Amenities. Nah, I don't need amenities or anything. Uh, industrial zone, maybe. Commercial hub would be great. I think uh, we should go for commercial hub or theater square. It's a new one. Uh, new wonders. So I'm going to go for this one. I'm going to build uh, some wonders in here. And over here, aqueduct, not really. Holy site, definitely, maybe. Or uh, observatory. Let's go for the main stuff first. Observatory right here. Oh, we're gonna get some. We're gonna get you right here. There we go. An observatory right there, boys. Choose a production. Over here, we're gonna get some lighthouse. We're gonna go for the lighthouse right here. And for our new city, next thing we're gonna build for you, I guess, the sewers. Sewers big time because you're gonna need to have some housing over there. Yes, there we go. We're friends with her. Good. That's good news. And uh, next thing, we can purchase, actually there's some units right that we can purchase, uh, especially planes. Now I do need to see though, uh, planes, where they, where they at? So we can get some biplanes, would be really great. Yeah, I'm going to get some biplanes and actually I need to upgrade, uh, we'll get that balloon into the air right there. Yeah, I need to start moving him up, it's a little bit slow though. So yeah, I can get some biplanes, so I'm thinking... Just get a biplane right there. There we go. So we got a biplane, which is really good. He's stationed right here. So we can rebase him. We can just base him into the thing. We, uh, we can have two planes. But I'm actually going to send him. I mean, I got a plane. I can send him anywhere I want. Uh, I wanted to station here uh, him uh, over there, I guess. Uh, I guess the planes, right, you can't do anything with them. As, as, unless you're at war. At least we got some planes. There's that. The last tomb lies over me in Halicarnassus. Of such dimensions, of such exquisite beauty, as no other shade can boast. Mausoleum at Halicarnassus. There we go. We got another wonder. Pendulum and Don't cultural heritage. So we've got. Okay, yeah, no. Just go ahead and get there. So we got. Uh, yeah, we're going to actually base him in the air base itself. Uh, you. I'm just gonna head back, uh, head you back there. The scout, uh, let's continue on your search right here for more stuff. Fire started. The balloon right here, there we go. So uncovering more stuff because of the balloon. You are gonna just sleep. You're gonna continue on your journey right here, right along the shores. We're gonna go ahead and use our frigate. There we go. It's gonna have a promotion now because he's attacking a bunch of barbarians. Economics, not really. Do I wanna go for economics? Yeah, sure. Upgrade our market and everything. More money, right? Per turn. Claim a great person. What is this? A great engineer provides uh, towards wonder construction. Would be good. Would be good. But I'm going to pass. I don't need him. And uh, great merchant. Increase the trade route uh, capacity, which I am going to get that. Yeah, there I go. Increase the trade route capacity. Over here, same thing as always, I suppose. Um, we can't get any wonders or anything, so 
what I'm thinking here is I just keep getting uh, more stuff, I guess. More balloons? No. Not really. A cursor? Not really. I'm just going to get some ships, I guess. I can't get those, though. I need some nighters. I can start building some oil, maybe? Well, the next big thing I can get is the privateer. So I'm just going to get some privateers in here. And the trader, I can get a, a trader right here, actually. But the trader, I can just uh, purchase him. So what I'm going to do, hold on, before I do anything here, I'm going to send him right there. Get that done. So now we can have two trade routes. Okay, so yeah, I'm definitely going to go for... Uh, over here, what do we need? Do we need anything particular here? Because we built the, uh, the wonder, which is right there. And I think uh, what we should go for right here ne is a commercial hub, right? We don't really have a place for commercial hub over here, actually, though. Yeah, and it's gaining plenty of gold, so we don't really need it. Industrial zone, not really either. I feel like theater square either is... Like some of these stuff... Oh, actually, theater square... Yeah, theater square, we do need one. But I also need a trader... I'm going to get a uh, bill of trader and the next turn is going to be done easily. And also, we're going to get over here what we were building on. We're working on this, the library. So we're going to continue on build, uh, working on that. And medieval walls, shipyards. Just get the medieval walls done though. And uh, for that, we don't have enough money to build anything or quickly purchase anything. We're going to go ahead and get uh, the granary over here. We, got, we can send some envoys, so I am going to send them over there and send you over there. There we go, okay. So we got another city-state, good. Got another city-state, boys. Can we... Can I use this guy? Yeah, I can use him. Okay, next time I'm going to be able to do it. And you, the builder, you're going to go there. And uh, okay, so that's that. Um, next, now we can get a trade route for sure. So we can, I can purchase one. Just get a trade route, I guess, over here. There you go. Get that trade route right here. We're going to send them to uh, Copen. Get a, a road system going here. See, the road is actually pretty good. We can just get the trade route done, and the road's going to be done by itself. So that's what we should probably just do. We don't need to build an engineer or anything to do any of that uh, stuff. That's uh, much better in that way. And uh, also, yeah, I'm thinking... Instead of going for that tra uh, the trader right here, I'm just going to go ahead and go for then. Uh, what else uh, it needed? I think it, yeah, that's what it needed, right? It needed theater square, so we're going to go for that. Uh, plus two, so yeah, build it right there. Theater square. And the next thing we're going to do, instead, we're just going to build another one like that. Yeah, we're going to just purchase these. At the wazoo. So yeah, get him over Chitin Itza. Get the trader right here and send him to Copen. If I send him to Copen though, it's not going to create a road. I don't know why, because it has to con uh, go over that. I don't know. I understand that. We got all the things right here. F 105 golds per turn. Getting a lot of gold, boys. I actually want to see. Do I have any resources here? Natural resources I can sell or something like that. I got some well resources I can sell. Uh, can you? Are you willing to give me more gold? Not really. He's not really willing to give me wars. But we could get some alliance, right? Military alliance. Per trade routes with your ally. That would give us religious. No. I would think economic alliance, but not really. We're not close enough. We're not actually trading with these people. I don't feel like I want to do an alliance just yet. Maybe the French Empire, though. French Empire, definitely, I want to be allied with them. So I think... Oh, uh, actually, get some whale resources. Are you willing to give me them stuff? Uh, one time daily. One gold plus six gold per turn for the whale resource. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. We can't uh, be allies with them, though. But that's fine. Doesn't matter if we can be allies or not because we're gaining so much gold per turn. It's crazy. So I'm going to leave it right here, boys. Remember to leave a like and subscribe to the video. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.